Welcome to Onivia, League of Legends Highlights. These are the best highlights from today's LPL matchup. Get a burn, his flash does get a ton of healing back from On and the heal burnt, but summoner spells have been used on bot side. Great gank towards the bot side of the map by Weiwei, taking the summoners off of Elk. When you play in such a short range, AD carry becomes very, very scary to walk up to a lane like a Nautilus and Jean. So much CC between the two. The Q is going to miss right there. Wait, wait, he's, he's back. back. You missed him. Oh, he's still there. They run straight into the hook on with a nice little show of faith and a bit of agility. There's the flash play from Toon on top side. Though Bin he is going to try to get the kill on her turret. Beautiful juggling and Bin and Shun make the play for first blood for BLG. Meanwhile, Wei Wei still hunting that bot lane. Bit ahead now that he has the Swifties, you can get the trades so easily, and that fourth shot becomes that much more deadly. See, oh, Shun is looking for Zika again. Only level five for Zika. They've come back and they brought help. Knights here as well. They do have the all out for Zika though. He's gonna pull him back. Bait sealed on Shun. They're in a lot of trouble. We have Knight popping his lightning crash. With a lot of AoE back, they're gonna push onto the turret here. Ben is just gonna go for the slicing Maelstrom combo, but a nice double knockover from Scout in the turret shot. The flash, Scout gets the kill, a double kill for him. And they did find a play on bot side too, as Gala got the kill there. They're not gonna get him either. And my goodness, LG set the map aflame. On the map, Shun yeah. is looking top lane one more time, but now there's backup for LNG. Very interested the static shift start there, but Zika being surrounded by the LG. They're gonna pounce on the Hung though instead. Nice double knock up there. Elk gonna get exhausted outright. Hung still alive. They got the CC right back on a Shun who gets all out it and Weiwei is the one that cleans him up. Now you're gonna get the curtain call out and slow downs on the bin. Commit the fourth shot though in the end. They do defend the turret. Although they're about to threaten another plate up here for BLG. Great form on Rally up the top to try and save Zika underneath his tower. On, on has been playing with fire a little bit too much. Playing onto the Rakan tends to be a little bit more squishy than all the other engaged champions that we're used to seeing. Two and zero. What? Only still level five. Just about got that level six. But now the rest of LNG are here. The combo. reset. Look at the follow through. That's the double marksman. That's the double ADC there. They're going to try to continue to fight over the Grubs, though. That's four already secured by BLG. And they're looking at Grub again here, too, unless LNG wants to stop. They are going to head towards the top side of the map. They are still looking for Zika, which they have been majority of the time. However, LNG are going to shove in that mid lane and push through there. So first items for everybody except for the support so far. We're getting the TP in from Scout. Shun, we push out of this uh, setup around the Rift Herald. They're going to try to find this flank going off right now. On, pops the trigger, then Knight going to hit the lightning crash. They are all alone back here. And sometimes the best laid plans of mice and men, while well, they go awry. As Scout's going to clean this one up as well. Gala is the one that gets the kill in the end. And that'll be two quick body bags. Away from the rest of their team, we also look back into live. It is going to be a second dragon by LNG. So both teams having their preferred side of the map for objectives so far. They're going to have to start clashing heads eventually as Ben is trying to dodge Ooh. out of everything. Does do so. And now they have the TP from Knight, who's going to immediately lightning crash. He's going to dive under turret here. He has the damage. And there you go. Ben gets him with a long distance shuriken. And they're going to try to push this outer turret as they have the Rift Herald spawn too. That's a five-man top lane for BLG. They're looking to use that Rift Herald to take at least two towers. You see Knight instantly back in trying to defend that mid lane push. There's a bot lane push for LNG as well. How much can they get out of this Rift Herald? Oh, what they is try going to get on? He's trying to spider bait out. The Death Charge is going to buy time, but it's not going to be enough. He will be one auto attack. Oh, they don't get him. Okay, finally. As that will be another one going over. It's still the charge into a tier two. And now that's two turrets down for BLG's favor. And a little bit of damage done to their own tier twos by LNG. G. Can the only downside for LNG, they had two lanes pressuring, right? They had mid lane and they had bot lane. However, Jin, he's not the fastest turret taker that you have as an AD carry. If you only have war, that would be the perfect TP flank. However, they need to know that LNG is committed either into fighting BLG or way far they into have this the information. trap on the TP. They do. They're going to pull the trigger now. It's LNG. They're going to try to pull, close the trap beforehand. But look, it's been the slicing maelstrom. They don't even need it yet. He's going to pop it. It's not even the combo. As LNG are going to pull what? it right back. Look at Scout. He flashes over. He's going to get him. He take down Elk. And now Knight and Ben, they're on the wrong side. Knight's just 
is dying to a turret! And BLG, they're caught with their pants down! LNG will take that all day! Massive team fight from Scout right here to save the day. Gala dies instantly on the initial engage. All the money is on this Jin. Losing him early on could be so detrimental. Should now is around. Both smites up and available. It would be a 50 50, but Zika definitely wants to keep the Sejuani away from the objective. That would be so, so point scary. for LNG. Odds here now, too. Do they have the, the wherewithal to get in there and shouldn't steal it away? Looks like it's not going to be the case this time around. It'll be sole point secured by LNG, and they trudge ever on. They're moving in as a death ball. Only Elk remains in the mid lane. They're looking for Scout. They might find they him might right here. He doesn't know. Oh, no. He doesn't know. They move. got him. They actually take him down. Knight just eviscerates him. And now they can maybe even move on to the Baron. There's the, the pings at least coming onto it. Weiwei doesn't have his smite up and available just yet. The Baron is going to get started. Zika's moving in. They do still have Gala and Weiwei alive. They just need to keep them alive for the fight. Got to get the vision in there now. They have their control wards up. Curtain Call has been pulled. Going down now on still on a big flank. Shun in the back of the pit. Taking a little bit of damage on the end of that one as Weiwei steps forward. He's trying to get the plants down himself. Baron getting low. 5,000 down. Shun out of the back of the pit now as well. On still on that massive flank. They're going to try to get Gala as well. They're going to flash over now. Fourth shot available for Gala. The Baron has been pulled off of now. Elk able to get away nicely. Shun backing in the push with odd. Very, very aggressive backs. The Baron maybe just started up by LNG now. And at this point, there are no HP bars for BLG to stick around on. He has to commit to it. He only has about 30% of his HP, and he's super squishy scout. He's able to refresh and join. Feels like a little bit of an overextended play by BLG, but LNG are going to force their hand here. Gala saving his fourth shot. He's just going to wait to see if they want to use it on the Baron. Shun around the back of the pit. Can he get the steal away? Scout's going to try to fight him. Now the engage from home. Fourth shot goes straight and on. Oh. He's gone now as well. Weiwei going to the back of the pit, but Scout's just been killing Shun. Shun waited way too long in the back there. He's down. Engage does go wide by the remaining LNG members, but they'll get the big purple worm, and they'll extend their gold lead. Incredibly great I patience. might just go in favor of LNG now, the healing. He's going to need to come in clutch. The dragon has already been started up, it looks like. There is uh, actually movement now. They have the fate sealed right Ooh. in. As Scout is just picking them apart by himself. He's looking for multi-kills there. The curtain call gets opened up by Gala. It's Elf that's getting chased down by Zika. Zika not going to find him. Glacial Prison right back. Converge is doing a little bit of damage now as BLG have to be pushed away. But it's all right as rain for LNG as they take soul. Hang and Zika did exactly what they have to do. They were beefy frontline walls for LNG as LNG were taking that dragon. And again, major props to Scout. He found incredible picks diving in yeah, they like LNG is doing right now. Right out. The, Shun, the Strangle Thor just separates everyone else. And that's a major piece of your frontline there. Kind of your go button for BLG. There's still the Baron up for a couple seconds. They're going to take this inhib and maybe even look at more. They feel like they have the presence. They have the momentum. They're going to take a bottom side turret and the end down there as well. LNG are pushing right here for the win. Five versus four. They're going to take two inhibitor towers off of BLG's base. And so far, BLG like I'm through from Bin. He's looking. He's waiting. Predator in wait. Turn. See, I tried to catch the observers. I got done dirty. <laughs> He was waiting in the bush down there, bot side. Just think <laughs> that you can very easily face check with a brom potentially. Rakan has been punished one too many times this game, specifically five. Gala really does hurt those squishy targets onto his gin. Four items now completed. Five, one, and two, three point five k up onto oil. On. Oh, they're in a little bit of trouble now. As on's already gone, they got the double TPs coming in as well. Curtain call is there. They have the elk flank now on the gala but i don't think it's gonna be enough now shoot has gone too and all of a sudden you have this really nice setup all these things that could have gone so well and what matters is the kills going over to lng and ben the only remaining member on the map for blg that'll mean a triumphant game one victory for lng and they clean house in a battle of the best 
for group ascend and it's going to be a slow and steady burn but a burn nonetheless and lng rise to 1-0 in this best of three these were the best highlights from today's lpl matchup click that subscribe button faster than ramus can say okay see you on the next one